Lesson seven C, exercise one. Rosa Parks. On the first of December, nineteen fifty-five, a forty-two-year-old black woman got on a bus to travel home after work. She was from Alabama, USA. Her name was Rosa Parks. Every day, Rosa Parks travelled to and from work by bus. At that time, black people and white people in the south of the USA were not equal. There were separate restaurants, hospitals, and schools for white and for black people. On buses, black people had to get on and get off through a different door. They had to sit at the back of the bus, and they had to stand up if a white person wanted to sit down, or if the bus was full. They sometimes had to get off the bus. On that day in December, nineteen fifty-five, Rosa Parks was on the bus on her way home. Some white men got on the bus, and the bus driver told Rosa Parks to give her seat to a white man. She politely said no. The driver called the police, and they arrested her. The black community decided to take action. They all stopped travelling by bus. This was a big problem for the bus companies, because black people used the buses a lot. Rosa Parks' action was the beginning of important changes in the USA. In 2010, the USA got its first black president. It showed how much changed in 60 years.